Boom. There's a new door. Oh? No one in, in Japan. No one hears you knocking. <gasps> Hit the lock. <gasps> Oh, it's bolted. Well, that was worth a shot. Unfortunately, we have our lockpicks in Spielberg. No, we have our. We still have our lockpicks and tills and shit here. Then why aren't we breaking into this man's house? <laughs> it's bolted. You can't pick a bolt. Fuck. Damn you, ship here on your advanced technology. Wow, he's walking diagonally across the alleyway now. <laughs> I get the feeling he's been denied by the game here. <laughs> oh. Ooh. Ah. Ah, this is the door to the David Blaine room. The door seems to be watching you. Who is that seeks to enter? Oh, we have to give a password. Mm hmm. We do. Or no password. Who is it that sent you here? A walkthrough. <laughs> Keep on. <laughs> what is the ML? It's probably the owner of the magic shop. My first is in first. My second, the last. Next comes myself. Then back to the end. Who's beginning me? Right, we got some fancy shit here. Mm hmm. This looks nice. <laughs> Good. <laughs> yeah, there's proper yes. ways of con conversing and mm -hmm. um, doing shit and thanking people after and all this stuff. So, yes. Oh. I wonder what Cher wants. Oh, come on, we were all thinking it. The voice is exactly the same. I wanted to point out the very like large fish in that blood tank that we, you know could do with an upgrade up at the yeah, top shelf yeah. there. That's, like, that's that guy quite is, a cruel thing. Yeah. There, four basic elements make up the universe. Did you teach you that in your chemistry class there, John? No. Um, no, we kind of moved on from that now. There's actually about, I don't know, 137 now at this stage. Like Pokemon. <laughs> See, we're going for the whole, like, you know, energy can be transferred and not destroyed, blah, blah, blah. Yes, of course. You can fuck around with chemistry, but not thermodynamics. Damn straight. Whereas my solution to everything is to set it on fire. <clears throat> that works, right? Burn it. Try that somewhere. Burn them all. Burn them all. Set them on fire. <laughs> I thought you were going to do the whole Gabriel Knight like seducing. Tell me about yourself. <laughs> Don't think he's got the Tim Curry voice for it. I don't think so. So this is where we're being taught of which uh, elements are weak to which. Ah. In this, in this game of top trumps that we're going to be doing. You're like, I've played Pokemon. I know what's weak against weak. Yeah. I mean, there's some level of logic with them. Okay, so we know that fire, earth is weak to fire. Good to know. Mm hmm. Okay, that's an interesting twist. Mm hmm. You have to contain fire. Must contain fire. You cannot control it. Hmm. <laughs> I get the feeling this. We really should be writing this down. <laughs> <laughs> Mm 
Ajá. Magnetic, you can say. <laughs> you spray them away. Interesting. Mm. This poor hero from Spielberg is going like, I don't like magic. It's all weird. I want to <laughs> I want to kick things to death. Can we cast a few spells back in Spielberg? Oh. I did, but they, you know, like everyone knows everyone knows some of those spells, but not this weird elemental shit. This is this is too too advanced for us. Yeah, these are fucking beans made of magic. I just like to chop shit up and make shit. <laughs> <laughs> He's just there at the end going, can I go back to Robin Houses now? I was good at that. Come on, is my accent not strong enough for you? <laughs> yeah, we do some healing up. In bits, man. Yeah. Ah, there you are. Been looking all over for you. I've been doing hell. an impression of somebody. Can't you tell? That's Crouch on Marx. <laughs> <laughs> What's that about the fucking Sierra games with the Marx brothers? Like, this fucking love it. We had this with Runaway as well. Like, the yeah. fucking final Runaway has a character who's fucking a waiter, but is also a Groucho Marx impressionist. It's like, fuck off. Like, I thought my Mary, I've heard of a Mary Sue before, but not fucking Groucho Sue's. Oh, he's going to sell us one of those things. I, I thought this was one of those fucking weird clown things, but apparently no. Like... Yeah, he's a salesman, apparently. <laughs> he doesn't quite have the same panache as uh, Stan to use uh, ship salesman, does he? I was about to say, like, yeah, it's easily what you're going for here. Hmm. But well, this predates Monkey Island by a few years, if I'm not mistaken. All right. Yeah. He, he needs to it, wave right? his hand. He needs to wave his arms around more. Yeah, exactly. <sighs> we decide, no, we don't need a source. We can walk into the desert alone. I think. We're still going to try. On, like, Minimal health. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wait, we would have healed. Oh, no, we didn't even heal from the fucking sleep. The no. Fuck? We got a stamina back, which is presumably where the uh, the sleep comes into the factor there. Mm-hmm. Hmm. That is the, the one time you don't want to get ambushed when you're going across the screen. Ooh, hello. The hell is that? That is oh, the griffin. griffin. Ooh. Look, Griffin, huh? Mm, Griffin. Yeah, you might want to say that you're going to take it on with like a sliver of fucking help, pal. <laughs> yeah, just saying it might be, uh, might do with a bit of a prep work first. <laughs> okay. Maybe this is one of our mini bosses. Yeah, there you go. I wonder what we get off this thing. Oh, now he's right. He's fine. He's using healing. Hmm. Might get like a feather off of her or something like that. Like we got the claws off the ghouls and. That makes sense. Oh, that's exactly what we're going to be doing. Oh. What oh, damn? I thought we had to kill the fucker. No, nope, not yet. Anyway. Oh, damn. That was expertly done. No, oh, about the full health, too. Ooh. <laughs> the Griffith's name is fucking Merv. Merv. Which makes you think he's got a really thick... Um, like 
Nord- <laughs> Nordy's English. Hey, Merv, accent. get the fuck out of here. We need to fucking relax, hey, Merv, get out the dang rock. Oh, there he is. Oh, here we go. Oh, dun, oh we do dun, have to kill her. Oh, what damn. Well, of course, if he's an element of air, he's going to be weak to fire. He's not. Or was, it that, was that not Earth? I think it was Earth he's weak to. Perhaps he's not. He's just a flying beast and all burbs are weak to fire. Ah. All right, here's something again. Gear. Boom. Well, that makes his uh, fight terrifically simple, doesn't it? Yeah. Take that, Merv. Ah, yeah. then he's fucked off again. Little dickhead. Is this is how Bayonetta got their inspiration? The fight happens over three layers. Yeah, exactly. Now, Bayonetta did it with, like, how do you fight three successive ones? Yes. Over and over again. Ooh, denied. <laughs> I like the music just kind of passed on. Oh, shit, we're done. Denied. Boom, come. Ah, oh, yeah, there he goes. Nice. Yeah. We, we, I like to point out, but we had no reason to kill him. We already got a fucking better off him. That's <laughs> mad. It's just like, we had no reason to do that. He's trying to get a bit of cheese. That's all he's hmm. doing. What are you trying to do? Yeah. It, it, should point out that the, it should point out that the reason why like, we're just dicking around here is that there's not a tremendous amount of things to do in the first three days in this game. The yeah. elementals only really attack the city come day four. Like The first three oh, days yes. are really just you prepping. Preparing yourself. Yeah. yeah, to fight like beastie, magical beings. Like, you know, learning about them, going to visit... Shit, also, yeah, but that makes sense about the enchantress as well. Like, so, like, if she only kind of like emerge in day two, for instance, then that kind of does pace the game a little bit. Mm-hmm. And I suppose, like, it gives you a little bit of time to get stuff ready if you're a new car, new build, as opposed to a new uh imported character, where clearly we have a bit of an advantage. <laughs> Don't mind me, we're just trying to find a Griffin's corpse. We still even looking for that corpse. I don't think so. I just think we're just sticking around in case we get an encounter. Maybe. We'll soon find out anyway. <laughs> that was that was oh 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 purple ah. dinosaur. Hang on. Hang on. I have to cast it. There we go. <laughs> Ear. Oh, the Terrorsaurus. Oh damn. I don't remember that from uh, fucking Land Before Time. Move. Doesn't seem to be doing much damage there, lad. <laughs> the force is useless. Uh-huh. That's more like it. Move. Want to heal up there, pal? Skip. <laughs> you must be you must be right about the pills because those uh going by the water skin they are salty. Mm-hmm. No, we're, geez, we're going straight into it. Fuck. <laughs> Holy shit. Think of the shit this guy. Given. Ah. Ooh, this is this is tight. Yeah, probably safe not to take the risk there. <laughs> I'm out of pills. I need more MDMA. Yeah. Oh, nice. That's ah. a good addition. That's a good addition. You just cheese it. Yeah. Ooh. 
Oh, we're getting not enough. Holy fuck. For fuck's sake. I mean, you got three fucking that? points. You got three measly points for killing the bastard. <laughs> That's bullshit. I suppose it's decent for leveling up, but like that guy, that thing nearly killed us. Yeah, you want to get the fuck out of here? You are quite low on health. And you better hope for no, for no random encounters. Going the wrong way. <laughs> <laughs> I do have this kind of mental image of him like running back to town. Chased by like a herd of pterosaurs. <laughs> like, ah! I wonder what that blonde haired hero was doing. Oh god, oh god. <laughs> Come to the drawbridge, don't let him in. Jesus. But the worst thing is that we can't even fucking get out of this. We have to let him finish his spiel. The fuck? I mean, I killed a pterosaurus. Does that count as buying one? I don't want to. I don't want to duck. What are you talking about? Again, after with it, with how low our health is, I just I, I just expect him to be kind of coming in with like just like the like gashing blood. It's like, uh, <laughs> it's like, hey, adventure, hey. Just oh, fuck. Are all over the kip. Yeah, it's like, yeah. what was a terror source? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah usual. I would give the feather to him. Mm -hmm. Okay, the fruit of compassion. Okay. Nice. We got trade him. We could we could probably do with a few pills right now. Just saying. <laughs> Obviously, if you do this quest more for him, then maybe his uh, rates will drop then as well. I would assume. No, the um, the bargain is linked to our communication skill. Oh, that's right. We were talking about this. Yes, I remember now. <laughs> Can't really rest here. But this is so much going on. You'll never get it. Get get a sleep here. Like two days before the new dawn. <laughs> Is this why the, the 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 game is in this kind of view? But if, because if you look up, there's like a massive moon with a face just staring down. Like, <laughs> Big screaming song all the time. Ah! Yeah. I am the sword of hellfire. I am not weak to water, contrary to popular belief. I'm a gigantic fusion furnace. You'll need more <laughs> fucking water to put me out. No, not the nectar of the gods. Oh, we're being challenged. Uh huh. <laughs> I did that. It's like everyone's in the house right going, Oh, will someone just do it to let him get him get him out of here? Maybe he'll break his neck. <laughs> do a flip. I just did one. Do it again! Hey, <laughs> hey! God, these fucking spot monkeys, man. They're ruining wrestling. <laughs> uh oh. Okay. We have a mini game. Uh, here we go. Here we go. First death of the game. Here we go, lads. 
A young David Cage takes notes. <laughs> this is emergent gauge play. I'm going to put this in the game mm -mm. and write every female character as damsel in distress. Uh, 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 uh. David Cage. They, they, David Cage. Whoa, whoa. Steady on. Steady. 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 And ladies and gentlemen, that is how to play Death Stranding. <laughs> <laughs> I should clarify, we are going to add churches and low roar in, in post production, but that's pretty much the gist of the game. Yeah, we'll fix them in post. <laughs> We're going to do it again. We're better. I'm just imagining the guy's just gonna cut the rope just when we're walking past him. I was like, ah, no one can outstage me. <laughs> Did they do this three times, really? I'm taking this one a bit slower. I do, I do, I do, I do respect what the speed is going at. It actually looks like he's just flagging just to add a bit of flair to it. <laughs> yeah. I can do this right here. Yeah, he's doing it. He's flailing sarcastically. Mm. <laughs> Great. Now, leave? <laughs> Just there, stand, standing wide leg going, well, that's me out of business. <laughs> Imagine the shame being outdone by an outsider. Ah, we have many. Oh, nice. It's stone cold. What? You want to make some swords and daggers, you stupid son of a bitch? Hey, kid, you want to see a dead body? Want to see a dead body? You want to drink my fucking beer? 100 dinars and we have to... Oh. Oof. If you want the best daggers in this town, give me a hell yeah. Motherfuckers. Oh. It sure does not. Our bargaining does not work on this guy. No, he's too hardline. He's he's seen some shit, man. Mm -hmm. I had some guy come in here bargaining once. I said yes. He died the next day. Let me think about it. Think about it, right? Think about it. Oh, we can arm wrestle him. Mm. Just the one? Come on, man. I thought you were cooler than this. <laughs> Wager? Mm hmm. Oh, it's a button bashing. Nice. He is looking into your eyes longingly there. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Oh. Oh, here we go. Come on. <laughs> and done. <laughs> Not impressed. Didn't hurt. I think one was enough. I think we made a point. We can't buy a sword off the fucker. We have to trade yeah. in our old one. Hmm. So let's go to the inn for some drink.
There we go. Oh my god, a cutscene. That's the dance. Yeah. This one's for the furry fanboys. Yeah. Here's the furry bait. Look at all that animation, eh? Breathtaking. I'm going to have to... Um... It's going to sound like it's interesting, but have you got any bleach on your side? <laughs> anything kind of like peroxide, so any kind of baking soda, anything basic, really. Yeah, yeah, like really low on the pH scale. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Anything like that. Fuck it. I've, I've I got some, I think I have some caustic soda under the sink. That'll right. do it. Can you, uh, can you pass it over to me when you're done with it? Because uh, I, I don't want to see anything anymore after this. I, I, <laughs> my eyes are gone. I, I can't. Hi-ya. And go clap. Yeah, now that's a pre-show. What the hell is the main event, I ask you? Some people call it the Cuddle Puddle. And the worst thing is that that, I would, that, was, that wasn't even a joke. That's true. Man, furries mm-hmm. are weird. <laughs> so, can I get a cup of tea and the opening credits, please? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> I just know that the um the pattern on the wall on the wall there, the tiles, spells out Gwang. <laughs> <laughs> Bookend. No, no, no. <laughs> I like reading. I mean, I'm sorry. Oh, back to the money changer. Mm. Oh, she got a job for us. Ah, this is what we were doing last time, maybe. Okay. So, Nick, the tea set. Yeah, we're stealing shit. Woo! Oh, yeah. Thing? Uh-huh. It's unbarred now. Mm. Okay, then. <laughs> 